Regiment Phil Squadron provides uh, several flights to patrol the AA around the airbase. Uh, we protect the aircraft and also the, the people on the airbase as well. Um, today we're uh, out on the ground with uh, introducing uh, the Afghan Air Force, the local population, as a new security force that will sort of help and t help with the uh, takeover when we leave, and also when uh, NATO ends its mission here in Afghanistan. Koshab, uh, the village that we're in or we're moving up into, it's. Uh, been a bit uh, dodgy at times, uh, the population have been a bit uh, against us. Um, we've started doing some influence in the local area and then we're going to introduce the Afghan Air Force patrol today, just the two guys with their uh, United States Air Force security forces mentors and just introduce them and let them know that there's a new security force out there and that they're a very professional organisation. We, uh, we've had a few dealings with the Afghan National Police and uh, especially at one of the uh, local checkpoints and we've started working with them on a regular basis, going down, introducing ourselves, seeing what sort of assistance we can do and hopefully do some joint patrolling at a later stage with them. Also with the Afghan Air Force, this is the first patrol of its kind and uh, with their mentors as well and hopefully we could get a few more of these uh, in before we uh, the tour ends. The end result would be ideal, ideally that uh, when we leave and ISAF finishes its mission that the, the Afghans can patrol and uh, police the local area themselves without our assistance. We had a very good reception moving on into the village, uh, I was quite surprised um, and the, the Afghan Air Force guys seemed to go down a storm with the locals and especially the children. We gave out some football shirts which went down really, really well as well. Um, as we moved through the village, there wasn't many uh, adults around today. There were probably a lot of them out in the fields working. But the adults that we saw were very receptive, uh, and especially the children again. Uh, we've now uh, moved out of the village and we're looking, uh, moving back towards uh, Kandahar Air Base at this time. Uh, we're in a, a Zulu muster position where we get a, lads a bit of a downtime, rest the backs and then they can get some food on board before uh, we move back into uh, the airbase. We've had all the thumbs down, uh, Britannia no good, um, no response from you know some of the, the older generation around the village but today as we've been through because of the influence task over the last couple of weeks then it's been Britannia good uh, and we've been able to engage with some of the village elders so uh, as far as I'm concerned that's influence and the lads have seen it. I think this is the way ahead and uh, hopefully we have a few more patrols like this.